Well, you know, uh, we have a little tradition build here. Ten straight years in the playoffs. Eight seasons with seven or more wins. And now we've been uh, three deep, four out of the last seven years. So, uh, man, I couldn't be more uh, more happy right now. And But you know what? We I always said we want to be that first team to get to the fourth round in a long time. So, you know, I know we got an uphill climb. I know we're playing some uh, great team. I know we're playing a, a team that has great size. But it doesn't hurt to dream a little bit. And sometimes dreams come true. So we're going to be ready to play come Friday. Definitely the biggest and, and by far the best team we've played this year. And, you know, they're, they're ranked second in the region and fourth in the state for a reason. They got a free safety going to Mississippi. Quarterback, I believe, is going to Texas Tech. They've got some huge defensive tackles. They got a great tailback. So, you know, we're teaching on, we're, te well, we're working on rapping and trying to bring the ball carrier down when we hit him. Uh, he's a big running back, though. He's good. And their defense flies to the ball. So, uh, at the West Coast, you know, we're going to try to get those three yards and keep those chains moving. Yeah, well, all the greats from here where they've been to the third round and they talk about how great the teams they play. And we're just happy to be there. They're way faster than any other teams we played, that's for sure. And um, we just got to do the game plan that their coaches put us through. From the, from the start, actually, when uh, Coach Brigette, like put a lot of pressure on us about being in 6A and that we're going to play some pretty tough teams. It feels great being underdogs, honestly. I like, I like the feeling. I know the guys like the feeling of being underdogs. I mean, when you get doubted and prove everybody wrong, it feels great. 